Under the multi-party system of governance, the function of the leader of opposition is as vital as that of the leader of government business. I think they should have ranked rank the leader of opposition as the prime minister. That should have been his proper ranking. But because, you know, this government is just learning to accommodate opposition. So they find it very hard <laughs> to finance adequately. The leader, they think that if they, if, they, if they fund the leader of opposition adequately, they would be fighting themselves. So they are very, very cautious. In other words, parliament cannot be complete without uh, the component of, of the leader of opposition. In the nice parliament, this top job has been under the stewardship of Waflo Goto, who lost his seat for Kori Central. The party president will make nominations, will nominate people and present the names to the working committee. And I am a member of the working committee. Once these names have been endorsed by the working committee, then they are presented for the National Executive Committee for further approval. So that's the process of selection of the leader of opposition. Samuji is also interested in the same job, if chosen by Major General Mogisha Monto, as well as Dr. Umani MP Cecilia Atimogwa. Every FDC member of parliament is eligible. And I, I don't want to pretend that if I am selected, I don't want. But the guiding principle is on who will serve the better and the country better under the circumstances. I'm available. I'm available. Uh, what, what upset me in 2011 was that uh, when... Uh, Dr. Kiza Besige uh, spotted me out to be the leader of opposition and some members in the party uh, thought that I was new. That they should have known that even when FDC was being formed, Ogwal had to be a factor. There are some regions that have more opposition than others. And you are not going to leave those others behind because we don't have many, no. Republic of Uganda. Another formidable candidate for the position is Kaseso Oman MP, Winnie Kiza. And Agago knows Professor Ogenga Latigo. No matter how many or how few we are, we might seem to be, we shall carry your voice. If, if, if I am ever nominated and approved by the party structure, I can only make a promise, I can only promise to make a contribution towards the struggle that we are involved in now. And that's the struggle of liberating this kind of rescue in this country. And my contribution is not on what I'll do as a leader of opposition, but if I am selected, is what I should do to make sure that we rescue this country. And that's where I think uh, whoever will be selected, that's where the focus should be. Since the inception of multi-party system of governance in the 8th Parliament, Professor Genga Latigo was the first leader of opposition, followed by Nandala Mafabi in the 9th Parliament and Wafro Gutu. Regional balance in the appointment of the leader of opposition is also put into consideration when picking the law. Kiza will rely on the Trump card that the district she hails from elected the entire FDC MPs. Ogenga, who had a stellar performance and perhaps was the best lob, will face the challenge of being elected again. There were people that strongly um, believed that um, Honorable Nandala should have continued. But I think that the, the leadership of uh, FDC feels that people must be given opportunity. Uh, to, to learn and to try. Ogwara and the Semuju are the dark horse contenders. Ogwara says FDC needs to consider gender parity since women have never assumed this position. I think within the FDC we also have brilliant women who can be leaders of opposition. She says she stands a chance because she delivered Lango to FDC. They did not appreciate the fact that the Lango subregion, which is the pillar of the opposition in Uganda, because under my stewardship, uh, when I was the de facto leader of the UPC, I was able to wipe out the NRM from Lango subregion completely. What are the qualities of the leader of opposition? So it means that you must have the tactics, you must have um, very, <laughs> a very tough team that can handle hot issues. What is the personality of this person? Can this personality uh, be able to bring all the all the political forces. We are still looking for that person that will be able to bring UPC, bring able to bring, bring DP to work together with the FDC. It's not about FDC alone. Monto says he will reveal who will be the office bearer of this position next week. We are giving a statement on that on Monday.
is the leader of opposition who appointed the chairperson of the four oversight committees in the parliament. Jingo Francis, NTV. We